Hey, Steve Gardner here with EXP Realty. I just wanted to go over a really cool graphic I came across, uh, and it's a map of the United States, uh, and it shows how much equity last year, uh, as a whole, as a country, we gained in a house, in our houses, and where we live. If you own a home, and it's really, truly uh, interesting stat. Uh, what this shows us, this is from Keeping Current Matters. Uh, the average increase in home equity in 2020, uh, and you're probably asking uh, why, uh, what, what, does, what does this mean for me? Well, if, if you're in a, a situation now where maybe you, your needs have changed, uh, you, whether you're downsizing or, or increasing a home, you've got some power now. You've got some money that's, uh, if you've had appreciation, that's stored up. So maybe you need that, that fourth bedroom instead of a three. Uh, maybe you want a home with a pool. Maybe you want to downsize. You want to take the equity, a large equity uh, that is built up in a bigger home and downsize and maybe buy something with less of a mortgage. But here, let's take a look. This is pretty cool. The average increase in, in the United States was $26,300 in equity. And they got it broken down by state. Florida's 19000 Georgia's 18000 Gosh, out west, California, uh, is uh, Nevada, California, Oregon, uh, 32K. So as a whole, there are some neutral states that haven't, they're showing not enough data. Uh, doesn't mean that's not, they haven't appreciated, they're just not showing it. But as an average, $26,300. Uh, I found that very interesting. I hope you found this useful. Uh, if you're interested in any more of my videos, you know, check out uh, my Facebook business page. They're all there. Also, you can go to my YouTube channel, it, subscribe, all of these are there. And uh, if you wanted information or interested in purchasing a home or selling a home or uh, of that sort, just, you know, reach out to me, you know where to get me. Uh, until next time, thanks and take care.